Hi friends! Welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I'm going to film a skincare routine. I just got home and I wanted to share with you how I'm going to remove my makeup and apply my skincare before I go to sleep. My skin type is a dry combination, so I have dry areas under my cheeks, on the forehead, but I tend to oil up on the T-zone area. So that's why my skincare routine is actually for more dry skin types. So if you're a dry skin girl like me, then thumbs up this video. Just a disclaimer guys, the products that I use on this skincare routine may not necessarily work for your skin type. I have been doing this skincare routine for more than a year already and I have achieved better skin than before I was doing this skincare routine. I just want to share with you guys how I do this skincare routine since some of my friends are asking me what products I use, do I exfoliate, what, how do I remove my makeup every day. So if you are interested to know the answers to those questions, then just keep on watching. So before we start this skincare routine and dance the night away, we have to first change into something more comfortable. Yan! I like wearing this t-shirt whenever I go to sleep. It's more comfortable for me. And we're going to put my hair out of the way since I don't want wet hair while I'm sleeping. So, this is a headband from Miniso. And 99 pesos ko lang siyang nakuha. Super cute, di ba? So the first step in any skincare routine is to remove makeup and I'm using the MAC Makeup Remover Wipes to remove my eye makeup. And what I really like about this makeup remover wipes is that it doesn't leave the skin dry and it does the job by removing your makeup. It also does a good job in removing any long wearing liquid lipstick like this one from Too Faced. Just remember not to spread it on your forehead. Here I'm using the simple cleansing micellar water to remove the eyeliner that I placed on my waterline. Using a cotton bud, I'm just slowly taking away the eyeliner. What I really like about it is that it doesn't sting the eyes. I love using this heroin make eye makeup remover because it's the only makeup remover that removes my heroin make super waterproof mascara. See? so easy to remove. Now it's time to take you to the bathroom. So I usually do double cleansing here in the bathroom and for my first cleansing I'm using this Nature Republic cleansing oil to remove the foundation from my skin. I'm just slowly massaging it onto my face and as you can see the makeup is slowly lifting off from my skin. Now it's time to rinse off the cleansing oil and you can see here that the water turns into a milky consistency. Now that the makeup is off of our face, it's time to remove the excess oil and I'm using the Neogen Green Tea Fresh Foam and I'm just using two pumps for my whole face. I always use the Foreo Mini Cleanser and this one creates micro vibrations that stimulates the circulation of blood on your skin so this is really a nice soothing experience for me and this is what i enjoy about cleansing so much and that is how i do double cleansing and it really makes my skin feel clean we are going to exfoliate but i only do this once a week i always use the skin food black sugar mask wash off and as you can see paubos na siya and I just scoop a little amount, spread it all over my face using my fingers, and then I gently massage it onto my face. I also use it as a lip scrub to exfoliate my lips, especially after wearing a liquid lipstick. It just makes my lips feel so kissable. And I'm gonna leave it on for 10 minutes. Now that the mask has dissolved, we're going to wash it off with water. I'm going to pat my face so that it dries. And while my eyebrows are still damp, I fix them so that they are in place. 
also push my eyelashes upward so that they are naturally curled. But we are done with the bathroom, we are going back to my room. You can really feel smooth after doing that exfoliating scrub. I'm going to use the Sun and Parks Beauty Water as a facial toner and I use a cotton pad and place it on my fingers like so. Then I just swipe the cotton pad across my face gently and going outwards. Using what's left, I also put on my neck and elbows. Here I'm using the Innisfree Green Tea Seed Serum and this is great for dry skinned people like me. I use two pumps and I just use my hands to spread it all over my face. And I don't know how to pronounce this but it's Chica Ichigo and it's a skin glow essence and I use one pump and place it on the high points of my cheeks and this really makes my skin look dewy. Here I'm using the Midnight Recovery Eye from Kiehl's and this is my favorite eye cream so far. It really lessens the swelling of my eye bags and I just place it, tap it around my under eyes and my eyelids. And I really love putting on face masks and for today, I chose this Pure Smile face mask that I bought from Japan. And what I like about it is that it looks like I'm a dog! I usually leave on the face mask for 10 minutes and while I'm waiting for the mask, I play with my dogs. Before the mask dries, I take it off and then I gently pat what's left on my face. I put castor oil on my eyebrows and I bought this from Healthy Options and it really makes my eyebrows grow fuller. Then I'm using the Heroin Make Eyelash Serum and it really makes my eyelashes look fuller. Then to prevent acne, I use the aloe vera gel from Holika Holika and I just pat it all over my face and I use it as a sleeping pack. Last, I really like putting on the Carmex lip balm before I sleep because it makes my lips smooth. So that is how I do my skincare routine guys. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a thumbs up. If you have any questions about the products that I will be using on this skincare routine, click the description box just under the screen and I will be listing all the products that I have been using. And it's time for me to go and sleep guys. If you enjoyed this video, hit the thumbs up button and subscribe. I'll see you on my next video. Bye!